What? Should we get a test? <laughs> why though? Like, <laughs> like how cool would that be to find Just out? this morning I said on the forecast that it was gonna rain like all day and it's 8 a.m. and nothing I normally don't actually like it when it rains but I was looking forward to it for once maybe because it'll put me more in the Christmas spirit do you guys have the caramel brulee latte yet I do can I get a grande one of those with an extra shot and then I'm also gonna get a grande um, oat milk honey latte perfect it's just gonna be 1160 the window was needed thank you so much Oh my god, I didn't even think about that their Christmas cups are out. Okay, that settles it. I'm gonna ask Justin if we can decorate today. Oh my goodness! Oh, it's hailing. It's hailing? Do you hear it? That's hail. Oh no, I see it, I see it. That's hail. This is California hail. There was like two seconds of hail right there. That's it. Oh, there it is again. Whoa! We always think we have more Christmas decor than we actually do. Guess we have to go yeah, buy yeah. some more. As long as it's no more pillows. Oh my gosh, we have like 50 Christmas pillows. Michelle is obsessed <laughs> with getting pillows, you guys. It's that's like your one not just during Christmas. Like your one oh my your one, one flaw. weakness oh is like God. when you go to Home Goods and you see pillows you like, you come home. Can't help myself. It's storing pillows after holiday seasons. <laughs> Most of the stuff, like storage areas that we have, is filled with pillows. You're like, what's that? I'm like, pillows? You're like, what's that taking up all that space? I'm like, oh, more pillows. Bags full of pillows. They're so cute. Oh wait, I actually need help. Where are we gonna put the Christmas tree this year? Because Justin and I are arguing about it. I think the only place we can put it. So last, so last year it was in this corner, which we can't put it here now because we have shelves and the little sideboard here. The only other place is right here. And Justin thinks that it's gonna take up too much of the space, but. It's gonna come out to like right here. He wants to put it in the playroom like, where the kids are gonna crawl all over like, it and pull be things like right down. in the way of like foot traffic. Like this whole area. Yeah, but I would rather have that than the kids pull stuff off the Christmas tree. And I know and make there's not a really good place, but I was thinking just on the other side. <sighs> Should have thought about it before hanging up those shelves on the wall. It was all your idea. You're right, because I did it. It's my favorite day of the month. Hello Fresh Meals are here. Today I'm going to be making a pork sausage spalone, a spalone, bologna, spaghetti bologna, spaghetti bologna meal. Bologna. If you guys haven't heard of HelloFresh, by the way, their meal kit delivery service, I've been using them for years now. I love them. They're so easy, they're so simple. They send you everything you need in your bag to make your meals. The meals are delicious. I'm picking this one because I have about 25 minutes before Emma goes down for her nap. And this meal says that it will take 25 minutes, exactly. That's why I love their meals. They're super fast. Um, they take about 30 minutes, but they have ones that even take 20 or less. So quick and easy and gets the job done. Another thing I love about them is how easy their recipe cards are to follow. It tells you everything you need and obviously it's all in the bag for you, but it's super simple to follow along. Oh my God, this 
looks so good. I love that HelloFresh offers so many different recipes every week because I feel like I get stuck in like a recipe rut and I end up just making the same things every week. All their ingredients are also pre-portioned, so there's less waste and you end up eating all of the food that you make. Also means less prep work. But my personal favorite thing is how easy it is to change up the schedule. If you need to skip a week, if you're going out of town, or if you just don't need meals that week, you can easily pause or skip weeks at a time. It's really easy for families that don't have a consistent schedule and Looks so good. And Justin's favorite part of the HelloFresh meal mm. is eating it. It's every time you always give me a plate. <laughs> mm. They always give me an amazing code for you guys, and they're giving me $90 off plus free shipping. It includes free shipping on your first order at HelloFresh.com. So make sure you guys go check it out. The code is just Rochelle and Justin90. I love when you guys tag me in your HelloFresh meals on Instagram because I love it so much. They're so good. <laughs> it's just, it's not Christmassy enough. Please, can you please sit the tree up? Come on, imagine it, imagine it. With it lit up tonight when we just wanna like chill and we have the tree just right here where you don't want it. Beautifully lit. I'm sorry to sit, to, oh, I can't even talk. <laughs> Fine, let's sit on the tree. What else? Look at this one. Mermaid. <laughs> Mermaid. I need a dinosaur. You want to put it on the tree? You want to put it on the tree? Yeah. Daddy's going to show you how, okay? Watch. Put it right here. Look. <sighs> you put See, it on a branch. On. <laughs> it stays like that. Want to do another one? Do another one? <laughs> yes. She's going back yes. to look for more. Mermaid. Mermaid. It's Ariel? Yeah. Kind of, yeah. I remember, I remember like dreaming about this day. Oh, you did it by yourself that time. You put it Good up. Good job, Emma. Mommy it's a mommy dinosaur. I literally do you remember talking about this. Like, I think we even vlogged about it the first Christmas where like our embryo transferred to the work and yeah. we were talking about how we couldn't wait. Wanted to be able to start these like little traditions and stuff. That's so cool. She's like but at the age where she can finally <laughs> oh, start. Like, I know where we can actually start doing it. it like doing last things. year we couldn't do this type of stuff really because she didn't get it. But I feel like now she's talking. She can actively participate and engage in it. And now we can like finally get started doing this stuff with her. It's so fun. I'm gonna put up the lights while you run the errands. Okay. So by the time Sounds you get good. home, it's gonna be done. Well, maybe we'll Not see done. if she lets me. Other ornaments. You want to see the rain? Let's go see. I have been thinking lately though, like since we we're starting to finally grow our family, like I don't know how interesting it would be to get like tested again after like years of like it be if if I'm in, like if we're infertile still, like if we still have any issues, like how interesting would that be? I don't. I, don't I mean, know. I think you just have to like pay for something like that out of pocket. I know, but I just like the thought occurred to me. Like I wonder after all this time. If we could get pregnant. Like, if you, like, if anything changed, do you mean? Like, your, yeah. your like it's been, analysis it's changed? It's been, what, five years, years now since Six I've gotten years. tested? Well, you got tested when we were just 20. 20. Yeah. Like, so you had just turned 21. Yeah. No, or, no so five you got the 20. test done when you were 21. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, so five was, years now since I've gotten tested. <laughs> what? Should we get a test? <laughs> why, though? Like, why? <laughs> like, how cool would that be to find just, out? Just though? out of curiosity. Like, to be like, like well, I mean, I guess when I think about it, it's like I kind of want to know if we still can. Yeah. Like, what are the chances that because we can get not, pregnant like, naturally? Yeah. Exactly, like. exactly. To be like, hey, we need to be like super careful, or like, hey, if we want to try, we can try. I don't know. Yeah, but we I wonder still how have much it costs. Well, I was active duty when we got that test, so I don't even know how much that costs. Uh, we'd have to we look did into it. it. We did two. We did one when you were active duty, yeah. and then we did it. We paid for one out of pocket through. It was only like two hundred and something dollars, I think, for your test. I think my tests were more. Yeah. Because because mm. they have to do more mm -hmm. than what you have to do to get a test. Kind of, hey, it's a lot of hard work. Oh fun. my god. But how crazy would that be to like see if we could get pregnant naturally? Like, I mean, obviously we could. We I know that we could. I think it's more like a curiosity. But there's a super small thing. chance. But I wonder 
what the chances are nowadays. I think it's more just you uh, want to know. Like, I do has anything know. changed? I don't know. That thought like just six years. I don't know why, but that thought just kind of came to well, me. Well, because like, it. I've heard those stories. Of people oh yeah, say, we like, have friends that they have had done male that. factor. Yeah. I've heard a lot of stories about like um, oh, yeah. women women ending up like getting pregnant again after yeah. fertility issues, but I don't really hear that story with men. Yeah, I, don't I don't know, know why. Um, I just don't really hear it. But when I do, I'm curious. Like, yeah. I wonder if something changed. I don't know. No, I don't know. That would cost us money just for just to give me answers, which is something I'm all about. But I, I don't know about you. I like it though. It's a cool thought. Aside from that, I'm gonna put these lights up on the tree while Justin is away at the store. He had to go pick up a couple things we need, and I would film it, but I think it'll take a million years because it takes me so long. So I'm just gonna do this real quick. No, it's weird. I was gonna put up ornaments, but Rochelle's like, I don't want to do ornaments this year, so this is how she wants it. What? I actually do want to put them up, but I don't want to do it tonight. This thing takes forever and i literally like cut my hand up sticking it in to do the lights because i don't know why i didn't do a pre-lit tree well and you have like an allergic reaction to this tree it happened last year we remember that last year you were sneezing like crazy after we put it up and your hand was super red earlier yeah, I had, getting in yeah, there. it was like all red it's better now so this looks so weird because you come down the hallway and it's just right here but i love it <laughs> what is it it's a box. Watch out, I gotta open it. <laughs> my Christmas present to myself is here. Actually, Justin said I couldn't ask Dude, for this. I got for it for you. <laughs> he said was I was surprise. not. I was like, look, look what I got for you. Remember? Yeah, okay. You remember? He actually said I'm not allowed to ask for this for Christmas, so I ordered it anyways as like a gift to both of us. Okay, I cannot open this. Here, you hold this. <laughs> it's too big. Go. Okay, I'm so excited right now. I'm such a mom, but I'm so excited. We've been needing new pots and pans, and we decided to get these ones. They are so well, highly rated, and they look so nice. They even feel amazing. Oh my gosh. But now, the best part of setting up the Christmas tree. 